Alright, let's start part three. Uh, I do want to go get a potion, because we're going to start exploring these, uh, these dungeons more. And we've got this wooden sword that really ain't worth anything <laughs> currently. Magic wand's nice, but as we know, it doesn't work for everything. So I'm going to head over to this location and get a potion. I say that like you guys can see the map. I need to get like a camera that I can put above me facing down on my desk here so you guys can see all the stuff I put on the map but I write so small on this map to fit everything I don't even know if you guys will be able to see that so all right while I'm gonna go get this potion uh, I also would like to check out what we believed was the bomb upgrade so if anybody remembers where that location was what dungeon that was in I believe that's what it was it was like a hundred and some rupees um, we might as well go ahead and do it while, we, while we've got the rupees. Because really, anything the only other thing that we'll need to buy is the bait. And of course, as many potions that I want to buy. So I am going to stop and fight some of these enemies off to get some more rupees. That's nice. There's some nice. That's good. Bombs. And if we ever need to buy bombs... Uh, the bombs were very cheap in this. They were very cheap. So I know there's a potion. I think it's a screen down. Should I buy the potion first? Or do I save it for the bombs? Unity, the bomb upgrade was all the way at the top of the map in level 5. Okay. Level 5. All right, so we com yeah we completed level five. We got the item, the Triforce, and the heart piece. That item we got was the ladder. And that oh wow, that's literally right on this screen. That works out tremendously. Um, so we will let's go in here. Let's hold off on the potion. Let's go see how much the bomb upgrade is. And wait, wait, hold on. What do you say that was? All the way at the top of the map in level 5. Okay. So we gotta find our way up there. I'll tell you, I would love to find the magic key. And I think it's level 8 and 9 where there's multiple items. And I hope that that stays true in this. So, like, I'll know that, you know, level 1 only had one item and all of that, you know. I won't have to worry about... leaving items behind and that could happen i mean it, it might come down to a situation where we'll have to go back at the end of the game if we're missing something i mean i hope it doesn't it's going to take a lot of time probably all right we're fighting these guys off here yeah, we haven't found any of the boomerangs either surprisingly uh, let's see. Banana Republic. Is it possible to beat the game and not fight Ganon? Um, so, I know there have been some things that I have been told about Zelda Randomizer that is just completely, uh, not the case. And, and I'm not saying that it was just bad information. Uh, it's just, it's Zelda Randomizer. So, really, anything can happen. And I'm not that familiar with it. Like, this is my first complete go around with Zelda randomizer but um, so like I don't know I have been told though that uh, the the room will not open unless Ganon is is defeated so even if she's not in the room under Ganon or I'm sorry above Ganon where she is normally in the game uh, it will it, it won't open Nice. Hey, we're heading out. Should I fight them? I might as well. The room I do want is up top there, but I was curious about this room here on the left. Yeah, see, this sword, it's not bad. And don't get me wrong, it's nice to have, but... Look, look at the wand, man. I haven't touched these guys. And look how much faster I feel like they go down. 
we need to upgrade this sword. And I don't know how many heart pieces. I think normally it's... I think it's 12. When you can finally upgrade. Uh, to the, to the magical sword. Oh boy, we gotta take these guys out. Let me see here. Have you checked the... I'm gonna read that, I promise you. Have you checked the bombable wall to the left of the cave with the book? I can't remember if I did or not. I want to say that I did. But that also reminds me, we should probably go pick up the book. You don't need it to complete the game. Tell you what we really need, though, I, I believe the most. And that is the, the bracelet so we can move some of the rocks around. Okay. So we need to come this way. Lighten this room up. You have to eliminate Nintendo or Xbox, which one? Um... Well... I would have to say I'm eliminating Xbox. And it's only because... Nowadays... The PlayStation and the Xbox are so very similar. They're so very similar, where Nintendo still just does their own thing. And you gotta appreciate that. I mean, yeah, things might not be... Uh, as powerful... On the, on, the, on the Switch as by playing, like, an Xbox or a PlayStation. But, like, man, Zelda, Mario, I would miss all of that. And there's, like, literally nothing that I would... I would hate to lose on Xbox. And I'm sorry for all you Halo fans or uh, Forza. I, I mean, Gears. I, I don't... Outside of those, I don't really know. I'm confused here. Because if I, if I bombed a wall, it would have been bombed already. And I've explored up there before, right? Oh, interesting. So I have to go in, is there a way for me to walk around the room up here? There is. So I need to go in through that door. Okay. Bear with me, my people. <laughs> I will, uh, I will get it. These things are so simple. Rupees, come on. Nothing. All right. Here it is. 119. 14 bombs. Let's go. Alright, so there are actually, what, two upgrades? Yeah, I think there are two possible bomb upgrades. So that's one of them. That is nice. So Unity, thank you for uh, remembering where that was. I should have wrote that down. I've wrote down a lot on my map here. But I, um, for some reason, I did not write any of that. I know it's so hard for you guys to see that. But all right, let's get out of here. So now I want to go buy a potion, which I should have enough. Can I get out of here this way? Guess I should have lit the place up, you know. Let's do that. Because now I'm curious. Ah! Another key? We'll take that. I wish it was the... Is it the magic key? I want to call it the master key, but... 
right, so we ain't got nothing up there. I don't think we've been right. Oh, interesting. That might have been where we found a heart piece? I don't know. Or the ladder, I think it was. Let's just check. So we have been here. There's only one room down that we have not been to. So we might... Well, let's do it. Might as well. We'll clear the dungeon. We'll know it's complete. Complete. Is there something stuck in my teeth? Oh, okay. This is where you need the bait. Because, see, it won't let me go. Well, we didn't need it. So that's nice to know. Might not, We might get away with having to uh, use the bait. We might, we might actually die from these guys in here. That wooden sword, man, just ain't it. That ain't it. That's okay, though. That's okay. I don't, I don't believe there's anything else in here, so let's just, let's just move on. Let me read some chat here. Okay, so you guys are still going on with the Nintendo Xbox debate. I'm an Xbox guy, not crazy about PlayStation. See, I mean, honestly, I don't mind either, but I tend to lean towards the PlayStation. Maybe it's just a nostalgia thing. Maybe that's why some people tend to lean towards Nintendo. But in my opinion, between Nintendo and Xbox, I think Nintendo just has the the better names, the better exclusives. I mean, you gotta think, you know, not only do you have Mario, you've got um, all that stuff that comes with it. Mario Kart, Mario Party, um, the Luigi's Mansion games, the um, standalone Mario's like Odyssey and uh, Sunshine, Galaxy. Then you've got uh, the Zelda games and you've got the Metroid games. And, I mean, we could just keep going and going. Uh, those are just some of my favorites. But Animal Crossing. and uh, There's just so much that, that I think so many people would miss compared to losing Xbox. But that was the original question. So, Eric Wheat says, Zelda 2 sucked. Mario 2 was okay. And I can't think of a sequel that I liked better than an original game. You know, that is something that I think goes around a lot. Like, that nothing beats an original. And I would say that is true for a lot. But, like, if we're talking video games, um, I'm a survival horror fan, so I'll go right off the bat and say everybody says Silent Hill 2 is better than the first. Um, a lot of people say Resident Evil 2 is better than the first. Um, I don't know where I stand on that, but, um, let me think of another one. Tomb Raider 2, uh, honestly is probably better than the first, but nostalgia hits me, and I love the first Tomb Raider. Um, I do like 2, but everybody seems to think 2 is better. But then if you even go into movies, like, man, I, I love, like I said, I love horror movies, horror games. I think Halloween 2, the original Halloween 2 was better than the first Halloween. Um, Child's Play 2, I think, was better than the first Child's Play. And we could go on and on for this for a while. But yeah, I'm curious, like, what do you... I, I know Zelda 2, a lot of people... I think we talked about this in the last stream. A lot of people were very... Uh, I don't know, they weren't really into it because it was so different. They, I think they wanted, they wanted a game that was kind of refaced like this game but re you know different same style same everything but different kind of a link to the past it looked better it played better uh, but it was it was classic Zelda okay we don't want to die here 
85. Wow, we just have just enough. Gonna leave us with five rupees, but we are going. I have a feeling we're gonna need that. All right. See, I loved Mario too. It was one of my all-time favorites. Yeah, I'm. No, no, no. I'm not saying Mario two is bad. I. I liked Mario two as well, um, but I just think, you know, for me. Three was my three was my choice uh, of Mario, and I love the first game. I've played, I've beaten all three of them, uh, the original three on the NES. But man, it's just uh, they were different, and and there's nothing wrong with trying to be different, but sometimes it works, sometimes it doesn't. All right, somebody said to me. Or they asked if I bombed the wall next to the start. Let's go in here first and see if we can get this book. So we can get the book. So let's... Okay, cool. You know, in my normal playthrough of Zelda, there's some, like, locations that I never bomb or, or, or bushes that I burn because I really just go and try to find rupees to be able to buy stuff like bombs and, and to go get heart pieces and all of that stuff so all right so it looks like i haven't so this could be big uh who actually who in the chat somebody tell me who was the one that said this because man this might be pretty massive and we're gonna have to give a shout out give me that white sword white sword bracelet would be nice um what else am I wanting? Let's just go with... Oh, the key. The key would be good, too. Do you know the way to Kakariko? Alright, we'll take 35 rupees. That's still that's still good. Not what we're looking for, but hey, I'm that this is awesome. This is what I like. This is why I'm glad we're streaming this, because you guys can help me out. I completely forgot about this location. So if you have anywhere else that you think I haven't checked, or if you know that I haven't checked it, let me know. Gooner. Okay, so Gooner was the one that asked about... Yeah, well, thank you, Gooner. I appreciate you, man. Keep them coming. If you guys got that stuff, we, we got items that we need to find, and I know we still have so much to explore with these dungeons and we're gonna head to one right now I just gotta let me clear this screen and see which one we want to try I said clear the screen and I go to the next one Ugh! <laughs> okay let me read here Let's see what we got going on Let's, uh, okay, so we, we completed seven, or I'm, I'm sorry, not seven, we've completed five, we've completed level three, we got one item out of level six, just the raft, I guess we could go see if we have enough heart pieces to, to get the the magic sword because I think we're around that location how many hearts we got one two three four five six seven eight nine ten I mean it could give it to us but I think it's 12 and even in randomizer it may be different let's actually um, let's check level 8 out next but let's go check the sword the magic sword location first. And then we're going to head to level 8 and see what we can find. Believe this is it. Come on. Oh. All right, so not yet. So level 8 is all the way over here to the right. Let 
And if I can remember right, we, when we went into, what was it, level one along the coast. Dude, that was absolutely brutal, some of the enemies that were in there. Wow, that sucked. So we are going to have to go up and around. I think this is it. It's so funny how you were excited to find the sword, but now you're upset with it, laugh out loud. Well, it's not that I'm upset with it, it's nice to have, but it's so weak. And you know, the fact that I was able to find the wand or the magic rod in the game is called. Um, that that's more powerful than my wooden sword right now. Okay, so here we go. We have not explored this whatsoever. So let's uh, see what we got here. Yeah, the wand is not a bad weapon to have in the game, but it doesn't work for everything. Yeah, see, the wand is something... When I play through the game original, or regularly, I use the wand a little bit. I've used the wand a lot in this, and I'm starting. I'm seeing that it doesn't work on, on many enemies. The overworld, yeah, you're pretty good, but not in the dungeons. You run into some problems. Alright. Oh, okay, I ran right into that trap. See, the wand doesn't even work in with them. The freaking dark nuts, man. So this is one of those levels that would have regularly two items. I love that we got water in this room, though, because it gives me some room to fight these guys off. It's not like he can walk out there on me. I'd love to get an item right here. Come on. Nothing. <laughs> so we know you can't bomb that wall down below. But we could bomb up there. But we still have a... We have a place over here to the right. Let's try it first. Oh, man. I hate these guys. These dark nuts, man. They're... They're something else. Ooh. Now, see, I hit him head on, and that worked. Can we at least get rid of one of them? Give me more room to breathe. There we go. stuff come on looks like a way we might be able to bomb up there there we 
go. Oh man, we get rupees, whatever. So... Let's try it. Let's try to bomb up. I love the blue in here, too. Oh my goodness. I think I have to use the sword on this. Do they make Tomb Raider randomizer? Um, I don't think so. I mean, you've got the Tomb Raider level editor levels that people make. Kind of creates a whole new game, but I don't think that... I've never heard of it, but that would be pretty cool. All right, okay, let me think about getting in here and fighting this guy. Oh, this sword. Okay, I don't believe I hit up on the D-pad. There we go. Oh man, I forgot about them flying heads, man. I'm gonna have to use a potion already. Got two things shooting at us. About to be three. Okay. I'm gonna use a potion. So we'll still have half a potion since it was the red one. Could use bomb. Oh, that's right. I got full health here. I can shoot from a distance. Now I can't. Come on. There we go. Jeez, man. No way. Getting the, um, getting the map would be pretty ideal. What do we got? What do we got? Oh. Let's go, baby! The white sword. So, okay, there's something else that I believe I was told. I think I was told that the swords would all be found in the overworld. And yes, the wooden sword was, and so the magical sword is also... But the white sword is just chilling in... Freaking level 8? Okay. Man, let's go. Hopefully, uh... Hopefully that helps us big time here. Good stuff, man. Okay, so let's... Okay, this looks pretty easy. And now, if we could just get that bracelet, or what else? The key. I'm kind of getting nervous about the key. I know we got six keys, but still. Oh, I need that. Come on, there we go. I wonder if any of these move. Okay. 
Oh. Okay, we'll grab it and, uh... Get out. We'll head right back in, though. So now we have... We have one item. We have the Triforce. We're just gonna... Keep going back. Now, there was that one room I skipped on. This one. Come on, if I can get rid of him. Ah, oh, my. There it is. So it only- that- that is very nice, because I've seen people who have played Zelda Randomizer, and those circles, those bubbles or whatever, they take them away from you, and unless you go and you, uh, go touch one of the blue ones, and see, that's just how I thought it worked. Come on, let me down there. Alright, before we go down there, I am tempted to go in this door that opened. And we've got another. What if this is just where that takes me? I can already tell how much better this sword is. Can already tell. Alright, an item? Give us an item. The red ring, man, that is awesome. So there's both items. Link in his red tunic. Let me write that down. Boy, this uh, this was a good one. Help, helping to build up our, our, you know. The red ring, for those of you who don't know, it makes Link stronger, so like, he can take more hits without losing as many hearts. He's more powerful. Also upgrading the sword, same thing. He's more powerful uh, with his attacks. So we still need the heart piece, and then... I believe we can get out of here. And who knows, we might have to go back and, and explore later... Uh, if we're missing something, but man, this is this is awesome so far. This is good stuff. Uh, let's see. Wow, the red ring and the white sword. What a great dungeon. That's what I'm saying, man. That's what I'm saying, clock speed. Uh, this this turned out good. I don't know which one we're gonna hit up next, but let's try to find that heart. Just finished the quarry. Did you ever play it? I did play the quarry, and I talked about it on my podcast, uh, Save Crystal, which I guess I'll go ahead and plug that real quick. Um, you can listen to that on Google Podcasts, Spotify, Radio Public, multiple different places. Uh, Spotify and Google Podcasts seem to be the most popular, but um, you can go hear me talk. Mo that's where a lot of my game reviews go. Uh, some of them, though, are over there that I haven't done videos on yet, so you might not have seen them if you only follow me through YouTube so but I did talk about the quarry and that's one of them that I did not make a video on I just uh, I talk about my thoughts of it and I like the quarry uh, I just hated all the language in it you know sometimes I guess language really doesn't bother me because I, I know to kind of just overlook it uh, however sometimes it's just done over the top and I think it definitely was done way over the top in the quarry but great game great story uh, plot twist didn't see things coming good stuff all right man I'm so pumped about this red ring and the white sword maybe if we get the heart piece out of here we'll be able to upgrade to that uh... sorry I was getting a phone call there spam 
But yeah, maybe we'll be able to upgrade to the magical sword. Okay, so I have... Have I been in here? No, I don't think I have. Two hits on the... I mean, these guys are the weaker Dark Nuts, but still. Alphos. Ah. Okay, we'll take those. Maybe that's a heart for beating him. We got SG Force. Isn't it funny <laughs> how bats aren't called bats? They're called keys, and the ro and the snakes are called ropes. Yes, uh, just something that it's odd. But I still think you know that's just what we call them. We call them bats. We call them. I don't know why it was made up that way. Why they did that. All right, let's see if we can try to do this with one bomb, because that would be pretty cool. Not going to happen. Not going to happen. That, yes! Let's go, there's the heart piece. I think we're done. Should we keep exploring, or we could always come back. We've got everything. I mean, we found, we got the white sword, that was item one. The red ring, item two. The triforce, and the heart. I think we get out of here for now. I think we get out. In my experience of Zelda Randomizer, enemies can drop weapons in the room just like that heart container was dropped. You, you mean like the swords and stuff? Because we're good on swords, or, or like the boomerang, yeah, because that even happens in the original game. But are you talking like somebody can, just any items? Because if that, yeah, if that's the case and we... We will have to come back in time, but I think right now we can kind of go out and explore other dungeons. Um, but yeah, is that what you're saying? Who asked that? Relic. Or I didn't ask it. How do I get out of here? I can't remember. Guess we can clear rooms though as we go. I really could just, you know, let them take me out. One of these. I don't think these move. They could also drop the key. They could also drop the key or the bracelet. See now, 
I need that bracelet because I think we're still we're still missing a level because we found level one level two three we haven't found four found five found six found seven found eight so we're missing level four and level nine so I need that bracelet let's go explore some more and if we are missing things we can always go back you know what I'm saying Ah, just go. Okay, so we, we went down that one as well. And we're out. Let's go. It's awesome. Alright, where do we want to go from here? We're actually pretty close to level one. I do want to check to see if we can get the magical sword, though. Let's go to level one since we found the white sword. And then once we get the heart piece from there, if there is one in there, uh, we can just... We'll go check it after that, because then we'll have 12, right? Yes. My GameStop location is closing down. That sucks, man. That sucks. Uh, where I'm at, we still have two. But, it's gonna be sad. And I know GameStop... Here's level one. I know GameStop does things that I, I like to complain about. Uh, such as, like, not selling a lot of games. I think the variety of games could improve, but... I feel like everything's just closing, and it sucks. I know it's so convenient to, like, shop online, but man, like, nothing beats being able to go out and get something. And I'm that, I'm not, I'm that kind of person. Like, I'll go out and try to, if it's a little bit more money, but I can get it right now, I'll pay it. I'm an impatient person, I guess. Alright, this has got to move, right? What? Okay, that's weird. When GameStop closes down completely, where are we going to go for games at all? What do we got left? Like what, Walmart? That's about all we got. Okay. Oh, wow. We got Wizrobes, Wallmasters. Come on, man. Still got some, you still got to still got to drink a potion. One of these got to move, right? Or are there still wall masters in here? Mm -mm. I'm gonna try these just to just to be sure. Don't think they do anything. I think it's just for looks in here. Yeah. All right. So we still have a way up from here.
Whoa! Where'd they all come from? There's the heart piece. Okay, so that's cool. Might be able to get that, um... Might be able to get that magical sword now. If we die, I'm gonna I'm gonna go to dude. Come on, that's a cheap shot, right? Oh, get it, get me out of there! Can I hit these guys. Oh, I can. I should have been using this. Get some range on them. This is freaking weird. <laughs> Just a Triforce in a random room. Alright, we still have an item though we need to find. So, we're going right back in. Where did I go from here? Oh, this was the the Triforce room. Alright, should I unlock? Let's go to the left, because this was locked up. I know that doesn't mean anything, but... We've still yet to run into, like, Dodongo and Goma. You know what else we need, too? We need that. We need the flute. Ah, crap. Well, speak of the devil. I don't, I don't think we have to fight him, because, but we can't, obviously. Well, I don't know, let's try it now. I was going to say, can we try the sword on the eye? No. It's got to be the arrow, but I thought because of randomizer, it might have been different. Let's go unlock this. Check this out. Come on, get my sword back. Dang, man. So, really, only need the sword on the whiz robe in here. This is gonna be fun. Another key. Let's try to get past here. What is this? This is uh, the Legend of Zelda randomizer. And, uh, it is fantastic. This is such a blast. I recently put a poll up on the community tab, guys. That, that's where you can always find out when I'm going to go live, because for some reason people always have problems, and, and it's just not me. Uh, it, it's a lot of people don't get notified, even having notifications on. It's just something YouTube, man, has, has got to get better with. Um, that was nice. 
but yeah, it, it's, uh, I'll always post on there when I'm going live tonight. Like, tonight was a, I put on there that I was going live at, at 12.30. And a good bit of you guys showed up, and I want to appreciate. I, I want you to know I appreciate that, and I hope you guys are having fun. likely bomb up. Okay. Ah! That is a bad habit that I, I have in this game, man. I forget to switch. Alright, let's go back now to the wand. Man, so far, level, what was that, level 8? I think that was the toughest dungeon we've come across this far. The Dongo dwells in the dead woods. Okay, so that's over there. That's probably going to be level... We completed level three, that's over there. Level two could be Dodongo, most likely. Okay, so we need to head back through. Can we get out of here without seeing? Yes, we can. So we haven't been, there's a room down, but we can Back there. Might have to bomb up in this next room. Oh no, there's a key. Okay, we'll go ahead and use it. See what's up here. Here's our item. Man, I hope it's something good. I mean, it's obviously... I think worst, worst case scenario here is going to be the boomerang. I mean, we can use it to stun some enemies to stop them from moving, but... You know what I want. I want that bracelet. Or give me... Give me that key. I forgot about the, the recorder. So now we can access... the Or go to the pond and, and play the recorder. Okay, that that's... Man, I love it. Progress, baby. I don't think there's anything else in level one. So we can probably leave, and I don't want to have to waste a key. I've got seven keys, which is nice. I say we get out of here. We will check this room down here. Oh, it's locked too. That's what it was locked to. So we need to go left, or I'm sorry, right. Let's just forget these guys. We've never been in this room. Right? That is right. Everything else has been searched except for those top two rooms. So if we ever have to come back here. I love that we're able to see this too on, on Link's map that he's filling out. Be able to... 
people take keys all day long. All right. Is Ganon back in Tears of the Kingdom? I don't know. I mean, from the trailer, it doesn't... I mean, we can hear... Uh... We can hear the antagonist, but we, we can't, you know... I mean, I would have to think it is Ganon. There's a part of me, though, that, that hopes that it isn't, and that we can maybe get something a little fresh. So tired of Ganon. It's kind of like Mario and Bowser. Like, how many times we gotta do this? Alright, is this the sword? Come on, give me... You gonna give it to me? We have, uh... Oh no, this ain't it. We're not gonna need that bait either, which is nice. Here it is. We were just one screen off. Let's go, man! Alright. Alright. So our sword is fully upgraded. We've got the red ring. I mean, this game is looking pretty darn good. Pretty darn good. Let me read some more here. It's what I love about Zelda Randomizer. This is so much fun. Piece by piece, finding the items to progress the game. Yes, I agree 100%. It, it takes the original game and makes it new again. It's what I said in the very first time I streamed this. I hope you plan on streaming more of these even after you complete this one. This has been so much fun and I really enjoy it, Prime. I enjoy you being here and uh, I have really enjoyed this myself. I've had so much fun. Did you ever eat Zelda cereal? No, that come out before I was born, uh, but I did have the most recent um, I wouldn't say most recent, it's been a few years now, Mario cereal, and that stuff tasted like straight cardboard. That was not good. <laughs> okay, so we need to, we need to make our way left to go play this recorder and see what we, we got. just want to man I'm so happy man what a what a great what a great stream so far went from the white sword which was way better than the wood sword we, we know that like that's nothing different but that's the thing you know when people played Zelda for the first time the original legend of Zelda they didn't know where those swords are. Now, yeah, we know where they are in the regular game by heart. Um, those who have played this. But man, I, I love this. Alright, so is it up from here? I think this is the fairy one. Yeah, we'll go ahead and fill up. And it's right beside this. Come on, give us something good. Watch this be level 9. Level 4 or 9, that's that's what we're looking for here. Oh man, look how powerful this thing is, I love it. My aim would be pretty good, there we go. Alright, let's play this bad boy. So these are, are these hints? Like if I pay, is that what that is? We're going to try this. We're going to try it out and see what happens. Man, that sucks. Let's just pick the middle one. Oh, it's, it's the gambling thing. Okay, well I only lost one rupee. 
Man, that sucks. So we still don't know. We're level four. Or nine. We, we don't know where they are yet. Okay, let's go to... Let's go to level two. We're right here beside it. Heck, I don't even need that wand anymore. <laughs> All right, level two. We have not explored this. All right, let's uh, let's go right. Well, what do you know? Just what we needed. Another key. That's good, though. That's good. I'm assuming none of these move. I don't know. I feel like I need to try them all, because it's freaking Zelda Randomizer. Man, we are getting keys left and freaking right. And, I, and I'm not mad about it. I'm not mad at it. Let's go right. Freaking Dark Knots. Look at this, man. This is amazing. I love it. I'll go ahead and catch her. Don't need her, but... Another key. Okay. Oh, yes. That's good. Good stuff. So what? They, the Dongo, I believe, is in this one. Because this was... This is the Dark Woods. Ah. Man, these freaking... Look how many times I've been hit and my hearts haven't moved. The bracelet! Let's go, baby! so many places we can check now so many places it's all coming together we still though and I know we got a lot of places to look like for the the other we got other dungeons to search and all the above but really the only other thing that I think we're absolutely gonna need is the bow and that silver arrow. And there's a good possibility that we might not even find those until we're in level 9. Just like where the real silver arrow is. Could happen. We're not done here yet. We still got to find the Triforce and we still need to find a heart if it's here. Could not it might not be. This sword is a beautiful thing, man. Alright, let's see. Where have we been? So we've been down from here. We need to move up. See if 
any of these move. Oh, we might bomb that wall. We'll see. Alright, um... Key, man, let's go. Just wait till you get to level nine, and it's super hard and very confusing and disorienting. Okay. Well, I mean, that's the largest map anyway, so I'm sure that it is, uh, you know. A lot more challenging. Eleven keys, man. Let's go over here real quick. Try force. Oh, okay. It's a Triforce room. Oh, wow, the Triforce is way down in the bottom left. So we're looking for an item? No, we've got an item. But I thought there was an underground in this as well. Okay. So where have we not been? There's like, what, three more rooms? There's the heart. Now I just gotta get the Triforce. We're not gonna use the key there. Because if we don't have to, we're not gonna use them. We gotta save those bad boys. After this, we will probably start wrapping this stream up. We've been going over an hour. Um, we are going to check a few locations, though, where we can move um, some rocks now. So we got to clear this room again to get out of here. that was worth it. Homie 
enemies got bombs, man. Hurry up and use this so we can save one. Good stuff. All right, man. Sorry, I need to see this real quick. I just realized I've been watching your videos for about six months and was never subscribed to you. <laughs> well, I hope you have subscribed now. Uh, that that does happen a good bit. Uh, like, I can go into my analytics and see that a lot of people that do watch me aren't even subscribed. So, if you haven't subscribed, check that button and see if you are. Please do subscribe. There are three Triforce pieces away from having them all. And, uh, let me look around here and see where we can move some stuff. Let's go through the the graveyard. And search up that way. my that was my turn no I'm not in the right place actually oh, I gotta go over one more This one? <laughs> this old man <laughs> taking my money. Alright, so that's a dud. That's a sucky location. Trying to think of ones I know of. Let's go this way. Uh, 
who was I? I can't remember. Oh, Maria come in the stream. Uh, Maria's birthday was the other day. I hope you had a good day. Maria, I remember that. You came in and said it was your birthday. I hope it was your birthday. You didn't lie. I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. Okay. Um, oh yeah, we want to go right up here. Come on. Let us end on something good. Let us know. Let us know there's something. <sighs> Where the heck is that? Yep, so that's no good. Alright, there's one more location I'm going to check before I go ahead and end this. Those things are bullies, man. Alright, here we are. Let's clear the space. Wow. Well, we can buy more potion. Now that we're maxed out on rupees. Um... Alright guys, I don't know. I mean we're gonna we still got more to to look for and we're still we're missing two levels. Uh or two two dungeons. So they gotta be around here somewhere, but a lot of progress was made. Uh which, you know, it's always good. It's always good. Shelly says Prime, there is another movable rock just three screens up from where you're at. Alright, Shelly, you talked me into it. Didn't take much, did it? I'm having so much fun with this. Like, I could... I could honestly... Uh, I'm getting ready to have dinner. But I could honestly, like, sit here and play this until we finish it. Could have, like, one big long stream and then I could cut it down when I upload it to you. There it is. Yep. Level 4. Shelly! Shelly, thank you. Alright, so we found level four. Do we explore it? <laughs> I think we might try. Heart piece, yes sir.
All right, heart piece. Cool. We already took care of Dig Dogger. to go to the fire. Alright, where have we... We have not been right, but we're gonna go to the door that's open. Okay. Woo, okay. This room's a bit spicy. Let's go right, because this is the room that, well, no, the room down would have been one we had to unlock. It's just like a whiz robes one, huh? That's awesome. Yeah, so this would have been one we would have had to unlock, so we saved a key here. Cool, cool. Let's go right. There's the Triforce. I guess we can go ahead and grab it and then just make our way back. I do want to kill this off, though. Oh, don't grab it. I'm not ready. gonna have to. Come on. him hanging around it. I don't want to grab it. I want to defeat him. Can I burn you? I guess I can't. Come up here and get you. Are these things not smart or what? All of that for nothing in this room. I thought maybe something else would happen. Alright, so we found the Triforce in here and the heart piece. So now, we just need an item. Going back in. Alright, so we have not been right. So we will go ahead and use a key to get in here. I 
think that's it there. It's a waste of key. A waste of key. <laughs> a wasted key. We've been right. So we just need to get out of here. Been left. Keep pushing up. Man, Shelly Shelly got me into this. Thank you guys so much for being here. I, I'm have I've I love this. We we definitely will be doing more of these. I know I keep seeing in the chat uh, quite a bit, and I'm gonna explain it right before I end the Here we go, it's gonna be our item. Before I end the stream, I'll go ahead and explain a little bit to you. You're going to have to look into it mostly on your own, though. Like, I'm not going to give you a tutorial. Not that we needed it. I mean, we will later down the road, because I'm sure there's a lot of doors to unlock in these other dungeons, and even the final dungeon, level 9. But now... We got ourselves the magic key, or I i don't know, the master key, the magic key. Everything's magic in this. It's not the master sword, it's the magical sword. So, where's that at? Master key. So I believe that is it, but since we're already here... Up at the top, we might as well explore the rest of it. Just see. There's where the Triforce would have been. that we just don't need. We can't even get over there. Heck man, we, we got the master key. We can we can use as many keys as we want now. that is every no we got one more room down below so we can bomb here it we can get out of here now man let's go so level four at the start of this stream we didn't know where it was ended up finding it at the end and uh exploring it to find the key we will do a recap here in a second
All right. Well, guys, that is going to uh, do it for this stream. I want to thank you guys so much for uh, hanging out with me tonight. Can't wait for the next one. When will you be streaming and how can I play that? Oh, yeah, that's right. That's right. I will let you know when the next stream's going to be. It's most likely going to be tomorrow, but if something comes up, I'll put in my community tab that it won't be happening. Yeah, uh, if you want to play this, the way that I did it, I just searched Zelda Randomizer. I downloaded it to my computer. It is a, uh, it's a program. And, like, you can do all kinds of stuff with it that you want. Like, if you want to make it really really hard you can like there's different settings there's like for beginner there's um like a medium setting i think that's what this is i think this is a medium setting uh and then there's you know a really hard one uh but you can change everything you don't even have to play as link like you can play as a whiz robe or uh we're gonna probably do that at some point too but yeah there's all kinds of stuff you can do when it comes to hints uh, different locations inside the, the dungeons, the rooms moving around, uh, which is what we've done here. Um, but yeah, like you don't have to sit there and do it individually, like just pick certain things. Like there's presets, and that's what I did for this. This is like the medium one. So yeah, just, just search Zelda Randomizer. You should be able to find it on Google there and, and find the, uh, the program to download and, and do this. Now, you can do it, you just play it on an NES emulator on your computer. Or what I did was I put this on my NES Classic. Um, because I, I would I would not even make it uh, to the first dungeon with, on a keyboard. There's just, there's no way. Um, so I put it on my NES Classic so I can use my NES controller. And that has, uh, it, it's done great for me. So, and I've used, you know, for my NES Classic, I use Hackchi. Uh, for those of you who don't know how to do that, you can look up tutorials on how to add NES games to the NES Classic, if you have one. So, but that's going to do it for me, everybody. I thank you all so much for coming in here and uh, spending tonight with me. We got a lot done. We're going to recap real quick. Here's my map. It is all marked up with my chicken scratch. Um... Let's see. We went and we took care of level 8. We got the white sword, the triforce, the red ring, and the heart. Man, that was a good dungeon. Uh, then we went from there to level 2, where we got the bracelet, the heart, and the triforce. And then we just completed level 4, getting the heart piece, the Triforce, and the Master Key. I think... Oh, we also upgraded our bombs at the start. I forgot about that. And uh, shout out to all of you who helped. Uh, and, and those of you, you know, who've got suggestions. I try to check the chat as much as possible. I have found that this is much more challenging than it is with Friday the 13th. Because there's a lot of, like, sitting around and waiting with Friday the 13th. And I don't stream a lot of games. Uh, but this was one I wanted to try, and, and I'm I'm enjoying it. But uh, so if, if I'm if I'm not reading your your comments in the chat, I know there's a, a good bit that I missed. Uh, please don't be upset with me. I'm I'm, I'm trying to get to them, uh, and and I'll get better the the more that I go. I'll make more stops and, and read. So with that being said, everybody, thank you all so much for watching. Be sure to subscribe to Save Crystal Gaming here on YouTube if you haven't. It was in the comments earlier that somebody had been watching my videos for how long and they weren't even subscribed. So make sure that is not you and subscribe. I will see you all in the next video.